आज ही डाउटनेट ऐप डाउनलोड करें डाउटनेट पर होगा अब आपके सभी मैथ्स केमिस्ट्री फिजिक्स और बायोलॉजी डाउट का सफाया बस अपने क्वेश्चन की फोटो खींचो उसे क्रॉप करो और तुरंत वीडियो सोल्यूशन पाओ डाउनलोड नाउ The question is so that the straight lines whose direction cosines are given by the equation al plus bm plus cn is equal to zero and ul square plus bm square plus wn square is equal to zero are parallel or perpendicular as a square by u plus b square by b plus c square by w is equal to zero or you can say that a square by b plus w plus b square into W plus U plus C square into U plus V is equals to zero. So here, here we have L is equals to minus of B M plus C N divided by A. And next, here we have U L square plus M square V. Let me write it correct here. Here we have M square V. Plus W n square is equals to zero. So here eliminating our L, so eliminate L. So here we get U by sorry U into B M. Let me write it correct here. Here we have U into B M plus C N whole square divided by A square plus of V. M square plus W n square is equals to zero. So now after solving this further, here we have U into B square M square plus two B C M into n plus C square n square is it plus of here we have plus of V A square M square plus W square W a square into n square and that is equals to zero. So now here we can write this value as that b square u plus a square v into m square plus two b c u into m n plus c square c square u plus a square w into n square is equals to zero. So now here we have that b square y u plus a square v into here we have m by n whole square plus two b c u into m by n plus c square u plus a square w is equals to here we have zero. Now this is a quadratic equation now this is a quadratic equation here we can see that this is a quadratic equation and so this quadratic equation have roots that is m1 m1 by n1 and second root is m2 by n2 and so now now here we have two points so first let's say that point a now point a is if the straight line if the straight line are parallel if the straight lines are parallel now the quadratic in our m by n the quadratic in our m by n has equal roots has equal roots so that is now discriminant discriminant that is d is equal to 0 now from here we have 2b c u whole square minus of 4 into b square u plus a square v into c square u plus a square w and that is equals to 0. So now here we can write this value as b square c square u square is equals to b square u plus a square v into c square u plus a square w is equals to 0. So here we can write this value as a square v w plus b square u w plus c square u v is equals to 0. So after solving this further here it can be written as a square by u plus b square by v 
plus c square by w and that is equals to 0. Now the next case is uh, that is so let's say that this that is point B. So now here we have point B is if the straight lines if the straight lines are perpendicular if the straight lines are perpendicular so from here we have m1 by n1 into m2 by n2 is equals to c square u plus a square w divided by b square u plus a square v now here we have this is our product of roots here this is our product of roots so from here we have that m1 m2 m1 m2 divided by c square u plus a square w it is equals to n1 n2 divided by b square u plus a square v now similarly by eliminating similarly by eliminating n so by eliminating n here we get that l1 l2 divided by b square w here we have b square w plus c square v and that is equals to m1 m2 divided by c square u plus a square w so now from now next here we can write here is that l1 l2 divided by b square w plus c square v is equals to m1 m2 divided by c square u plus a square w plus then that is equals to n1 n2 divided by b square u plus a square v and put this whole value is equals to lambda since now since they are perpendicular that means l1 l2 plus m1 m2 plus n1 n2 is equals to 0 now here this equation can be written as that lambda into b square w plus c square v this is our c square v plus lambda into c square u plus a square w plus lambda into b square u plus a square v and that is equals to 0. So now on solving further here we have a square into v plus w plus b square into w plus u plus c square into u plus v and that is equals to 0. So from here we can say that this is our final answer. Thank you. Class 6 to 12 लेके नीट आईआईटी जेई मेंस और एडवांस के लेवल तक 10 मिलियन से ज्यादा स्टूडेंट्स का भरोसा आज ही डाउनलोड करें डाउट नेट ऐप या WhatsApp कीजिए अपने डाउट्स 8400400400 पर